tables with a mixer in the middle. Even DJs that I hate, I love a little. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Hallelujah. Hello, beautiful LUTG Radio listeners. This is Kathy Brock for LUTG Radio. And it's December 17, 2012, 6.01 in the a.m. I'm so glad y'all made it because I know it's early. Early for me too, y'all. All All right, y'all. Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things unseen. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believe in him should not perish but have everlasting life. God did not send his son into the world to condemn the world, but that through him the world might be saved. Isn't that beautiful? That's for you, for me, every Jew and every Gentile. Amen. And Jesus said unto them, If thou canst believe, all things are possible to him that believes. Amen. Hallelujah. All we got to do is believe. That is so easy. All right. So let's do it. Say it with me. Pull it up on Facebook.com forward slash L-U-T-G radio. The morning prayer. Good morning, Jehovah. Thank you, Lord, for this beautiful day. We hear from you, Lord God, and are led by the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, fill our lives and surround us with your presence. Thank you, Lord, for your order, the sacrifice of your Son, Jesus, and his holy and perfect blood. Thank you, Lord, for our comforter, the Holy Spirit, who leads us into all righteousness. Thank you, Lord, for you are hope. We should keep your word in our hearts and minds. We should love you, Lord, with all our hearts, minds, souls, and strength. Today, Lord, we shall honor you by loving our neighbors. We are blessed to be a blessing. Thank you, Lord, for every mountain that has moved and every closed or blocked door that has hindered the preaching of the gospel of Jesus Christ is open. We are healed in our bodies and minds. Any disease or virus that touches our bodies dies instantly. The addicted are delivered now. The hungry hunger no more. Our shoes are replenished and resources never exhausting. For you, Lord Jehovah, our husband, made us rich. Your voice is the only one we follow. Your Holy Spirit leads us into all righteousness. We are always in the right place at the right time. We sow into good soil and reap abundantly. Everything we touch turns to gold. We sow seeds of faith daily and harvest seeds already sown. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Our spirits are not dumping grounds. No weapons formed against us shall prosper. We are we are the beloved, believing you love us and receiving your love. Not subject to temptations, submitting to your will, receiving the blessings in the name of your risen Son, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. For we always have more than enough all the time. Amen. The kingdom of God is manifested in the earth among the redeemed people of God. God's people ask for wisdom, ask for his wisdom, and receive it in abundance. God's people operate in the power of God. God's people have assured dwellings and quiet resting places. God's people are the created and matter in the earth. God's people light shines in all the earth with the help of the Holy Ghost and the angels of the kingdom of God. Jehovah our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. God's people are made to live according to God's world the one man cannot see. If God be for his people, who who can be against us? No one. God's people do not take the attitude of defeat. Those who accept defeat do not know who they are nor their position in the kingdom of heaven. We the people of God are the heads and not the tails, above and not beneath, going forward and not backwards. The beloved, the beloved and assigned of God, we count on all joy 
when we go up against the giant. We ask God for wisdom and receive it abundantly, standing on the word of the kingdom for all things. We as God's people stand on the word of God and all we believe lines up with the word of God by his divine righteous order. God brings us his people health and healing and reveals to us the abundance of peace and truth. The hope God gives us is achieved and manifested in the earth. We worship God of our own free will, not by force or shame, but by love and honor in the name of God's risen Son, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, our Lord and Savior. Amen. Most assuredly, I say to you, he who believes in me, the works that I do, he will do also. And greater works than these he will do because I go to my Father. Amen. Hallelujah. <clears throat> To God be all the glory, the honor, the power, the praise. Amen. Jesus loves you, beloved, and so do I. Hallelujah. No, uh, I'm not going to do it in Spanish today. Uh, hallelujah. Definitely hola to uh, every Spanish listener. Amen. Hallelujah. I thank God that uh, you're not only fluent in your native language, but you're also fluent in English and in Hebrew. Amen. Uh, so I'll be flipping back and forth, uh, trying to do as much as I possibly can. All right? Cool. So we get the altar call in the last five minutes of the show and music, music, music. And um, you guys definitely have a great day. Forget, Don't forget uh, to say, to look yourself in the mirror and say, hello, beautiful, because you are beautiful. Amen. And don't forget to uh, also love your spouses. Give them a kiss before they leave out the door in the morning. Hug your children. And I'm not saying it's because of what happened in Sandy Hook. It's a little village um, in New, uh, near Newtown, uh, Connecticut. Um, that's a tragic thing that happened over there. But remember to pray for those who lost uh, children and uh, spouses. As well as the family of the perpetrator, of the shooter. The young man needed some help. And so what I would say to you is, um, if you get into an, if you see a teacher getting into an altercation or an administrative person getting into an altercation, and you're a kid, tell somebody. Tell somebody. Um, and if you're administrative listening, follow your protocol. Now, I um, don't think that I'm harping on, on the dead and that I'm accusing the dead because I'm not. I think they didn't follow protocols because they loved that young man because he did go to school there. And maybe the principal did remember his mom. But people that work in education, they have a heart for people. And they don't like to uh, cause people to be incarcerated or put in jail or handcuffed. So they will always go out of their way. To see what they can do to help that person. They will bend over backwards before they call the police. No joke. That's just how they are. But um, I behoove you to follow protocol. You know, you get into an altercation with someone. You can tell they're heated. Go ahead, follow protocol. You know, let the police know. Let your security know in the school. Let the, po the police know. So they can, uh, you know, have a talk with them because sometimes it's that authority figure that will cause them to say, you know what, he's not really that serious. You know what, I should let this go. You know what I mean? And for young men, um, believe it or not, they actually need to hear a man say, hey, this ain't cool. This ain't all right. I'm not saying that women can't do it. Yeah, women can enforce it. But young men, and because he didn't have his father with him, he needed to hear the truth. He needed to hear, you don't do this. You don't do that. He maybe even needed a hug. You know, but um, follow protocol. When it comes to the children, when it comes to your own safety, follow protocol. That's why it's there. And don't be afraid to call the police and say, hey, you know what, I just want you to come talk to this person or this particular thing happened. I just want you to investigate. And they'll go ahead and do it. You know what I'm saying? It's better 
it's better to be, to be safe than sorry. I'm not saying that we should become a police state, because I'm not even for that. I'm just saying follow protocol and definitely pray for the families that lost people. So the only thing we can do now is learn from this and go forward and pray for those that have passed on and gone on to heaven. And may God have mercy on their soul. Amen. All right, so here we go. I need you by DQC. Check it out, y'all. 
In a world where there's not much to gain I got a pocket full of change And I've yet to use it A life full of light But I kept it exclusive Some wisdom and knowledge From these cuts and bruises A taste of reality I came to the conclusion Who am I fooling? This life is awkward To get in where you fit in With the right posture I'm not sure That's a lot to hold When you're stuck in the rain Saying I told you so Shoulders hung low With your face to the pavement Trying to find the courage And retract your statements And be patient Until it's my turn To keep living in life and let my passion burn. Come on, take your chances. Double up, double up for the snake eyes. Life's all about the chances. Some will swing low, some will take ya. High, some will take ya. Come on, take your chances. Double up, double up for the snake eyes. Life's all about the chances. Some will swing low, some will take ya. High, some will take ya. Certified official like vertical stripes. Typical type, right? Just another jerk with a mic. Talking way too much about my personal life. One straight And I'm first in a fight, learning to write wrongs in a song when I turn it on bright On sight to circumnavigate the circle of life Distract you with the left and then I'm working the right Get you addicted like a crack fiend slurping a pipe Not worth the piece of paper that I printed on Get it on, slow in the beginning but I finish strong Brother, trying to draw and clear what I kick, step, crush her All up in the structure, penthouse to the gutter Touch a couple levels on my way to knuckle up A sucker duck fell, I guess he wasn't quite tough enough Much is made of nothing on purpose, caboose Hope the long, hard wait was worth it. Come on, take your chances. Double up, double up for the snake eyes. Life's all about the chances. Some will swing low, some will take ya. High, some will take ya. Come on, take your chances. Double up, double up for the snake eyes. Life's all about the chances. Some will swing low, some will take ya. High, some will take ya. My name's the Gosh Dangin. Homies keeping Big Josh hanging. Praying for the big time. This time it's automatic. Sink life by the gums. Go at it. Man, I like where I had it. Yeah. But decision song one proved to be the wrong one. I have not done. My God is awesome. I play this rap like a gamble. Breaking up the chains and the shambles until it dismantles. What they call in the bomb, it's really far from. They play a sitcom with an everyday time slot. My rhyme got distinction. Plus my spider sense got an inkling. They got me thinking, could sink in. Maybe this weekend will be the time we end the pretend. The sea senses. All that exists, we all miss. Pick the dice up and shuffle your wrist. Now sing this. Come on, take your chances. Double up, double up for the snake eyes. Life's all about the chances. Some will swing low, some will take ya. High, some will take ya. Come on, take your chances. Double up, double up for the snake eyes. Life's all about the chances. Some will swing low, some will take ya. High, some will take ya. Amen, amen, amen. We got the altar call coming up shortly. Keep on praying for those that are uh, gone on before us. And then we got the people in Sandy Hook. And then we got the people that just passed away from illnesses and um, accidents and, uh, you know, other different tragedies. So it's all over. It's all over. So keep praying. Don't just focus on one place. Even continue praying for those that are affected by the um, storms, the hurricanes. They still trying to dig out. So keep praying, y'all. Thank you for your love by Kevin Jenkins. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can I talk to you a minute? Listen. When I woke up early this morning, I 
said, Lord, I thank you for letting me see a brand new day. Deep within my heart, Lord, I begin to praise your name. My life wouldn't be complete. If you hadn't shown me the way, Lord, I thank you. Thank you, Master. Over and over and over again. Thank you for the love. Keep on giving me. Ooh, yeah. Lord, you're wonderful.
Alright y'all, this is Kathy Rocks and it's about that time for the altar call. Now, instead of me doing it today, we're going to let Stronghold, uh, the group you just heard, uh, sing and turn your faith to the one true God. Um, we're going to let them do the altar call today. Alright? Here we go. Stronghold, I want to thank you for supporting this ministry. And we hope that these songs have touched you in some way. We hope you as a believer have been encouraged to grow closer to the Lord. But if you're struggling with your walk with the Lord, or perhaps you're listening to Christian music for the first time and don't know the Lord, we want to give you an opportunity right now to pray, turn your faith to the one, answer the call, and stop running from God. If you're ready to do that, then pray with me. Father in heaven, I'm a sinner. I'm sorry for my sins. I turn from my sins. I believe that Jesus Christ is your son. I believe that he died for me and that he rose from the grave and that he's alive. I want to invite him to come into my heart and take control from this day forward evermore. And I pray this in the name of Jesus, amen. Now, if you prayed that prayer, we would love for you to drop Go to facebook.com forward slash LUTG radio, click on the link, on the link, find a church, take the foundation class, get the baptism of water, baptism of the Holy Spirit, amen. And uh, don't forget, uh, read your Bible every day, the book of John chapter 1. You can also um, start off with the very first book, with the book of Genesis, chapter 1, and read a chapter every day. You just read it straight through from beginning to end. Jesus loves you. His love for you will never stop, and uh, I just wanted you to know that. Uh, also, you can um, you can still give to Hurricane Sandy through the Red Cross, and um, if you want to help the uh, families that are dealing with their loss in uh, Sandy Hook, um, you can check their city website uh, for what to do, but mostly pray for them. Um, they're not in they they need prayer more than anything else is what they need because they're dealing with loss around the holiday season so pray for them all right uh, pray for peace peace in their heart and peace of mind and pray that they may be able to forgive the person that took their child or their mom or their dad away all right and come back for the next segment which is uh, my peace and then that'd be up with about six minutes and uh, oh, don't forget, you can get you some uh, t shirts and gifts at uh, Breath Farts No Stalker. <laughs> it's uh, cafepress.com forward slash Breath Farts No Stalker. You know how sometimes you want people to uh, get out your face? There's always that one person that's always in your face and they stand a little too close. And you wish at that moment that you could just do something or say something that. You know, give them to give you at least 10, 20 feet, some, five feet. You know, with your little t-shirt on, or your little pin, or your little button. <laughs> we have that taken care of for you. <laughs> Alright, so definitely check that out. Uh, CafePress.com forward slash Breath Farts No Stalker. Come back. <laughs> 